Okay, here's Jingle Bell Rock. So here's middle C, move up to G, and put your fourth finger there. Your third finger will be on F sharp. Sharps are the black keys to the right of the main note. So third finger on F sharp, second on E, first on D, and our pinky will be on A. Our left hand, third finger, will be on B. So here's middle C, just go over one. Third finger on B, second on middle C. Our thumbs will share D, fourth finger on A, and our pinky will be on G. All right, let's take a listen, and I will go over every single bar. Here we go. probably haven't seen eighth notes before. Those are the notes that have that line that connect the two notes together. They're played faster. So when we watch this first bar, I'm going to say eighth note so you can see that they're being played faster and you can identify which ones to play fast. Let's listen. Eighth, eighth quarter, eighth, eighth quarter, eighth, eighth quarter, eighth, eighth quarter, 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 eighth, eighth quarter, half. So you can see they were faster. Now obviously you're going to play it as it sounds, so just copy the sound of the piece, but I want you to realize what they are. Alright, let's go over the notes. So we're playing G in the beginning in the right hand and B in the left. So G and B, G and B, G, G, F sharp and D, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, E and G, F sharp, E, B, E and G again, F sharp, E, B, D, E, and C, F sharp, E, C, and A. Okay, that's the first bar. Now, the second bar. A, B, C, D, E, D, A, B, C, D, A, E, D sharp, E, D sharp, E, E, B flat, B flat, F sharp. Okay? Make sure you write these in if you're having trouble. All right, let's look at the next bar. A, E, E, F sharp and C, D, G and B together, D, G, 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 E and G, and C in the left hand. A, G, E, G, E and G together again with C sharp this time. A, now, next bar, G, D, and B together, F sharp, E, D, B, G, G, E, and G, and C, A, G, E, G, A, and C sharp, B, G, and C sharp, A, okay, now the third bar on the second page. D, D, E, 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 F sharp and C, E, D, C, B, A. Now this is repeating. B and G, 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 F sharp and D, F sharp, F sharp, E and G, F sharp, E, B, E and G together, F sharp, E, B, D, E, D, C, B, E and C together, G, A and G together, A again, G, G, 
E flat, here's E, just go down, flats go down, E flat, this black key, and C, E flat, G, A, left hand G, alright, now the final bar, F sharp, G, E, F sharp in the right hand and C in the left, together, E, D, C sharp, G, E, F sharp and C, together, E, D again, C sharp, G, E, F sharp and C together again, G, A, now, G and B together, F sharp and A sharp together, and G and B together again. Alright, so remember, sharps go up, so here's F, F sharp is the black key to the right. Flats go down, so let's say we have a B. If, if it's a flat, we go down to the black key, okay? Now, you should write in all the notes and do whatever you have to do to get these sounding right, okay? Remember, practice bar by bar, really slowly. Now, if you can't play it that slow, you can play it even slower. And if you need to, do it measure by measure and have a goal every day of doing just a bar. That way you'll get through the piece. Okay, good luck. Any problems you have, we will address in class, but I want you to get started as soon as possible.